Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Mo Minecraft. That's right, I'm doing single player Minecraft tonight. Sorry about the last time I had an internet literally fail on me. It just decided the night was over. And it just went down for about five, ten minutes. So, there you go. <laughs> Good evening. Why won't chat work? Restart equals sound. Yes, if you're not getting sound, restart. If you're not getting sound, you won't be able to hear this, so... Well, I don't know. <laughs> I'm mentally projecting. Reset. Restart. Almost v well, WV subscribed three months in a row. Thank you for the resub. Did you try to? Same to you, Dalitus Drain. Do I plan on uploading my Witcher 2 save game to the Nexus? No, I hadn't planned on that. Thank you for the resub, Kelder. So. This is why I steal my internet. Good grief. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Sorry I missed the Friday stream. Most of you probably already know by now. Uh, I've been suffering from insomnia for a week. Plus working pretty damned hard. And... I was... Just not in the mood to try and be chatty and entertaining on a Friday. Not at all. I've taken, for the last two nights, I've taken some tablets that help me sleep. And I've had a couple of good nights sleep. So I'm feeling an awful lot better and hopefully my system will now reset. I prefer not to take tablets to sleep, but usually, usually about once a year, maybe twice a year, I just, I have a couple of days where I just need to. Otherwise, I... Just, I go on to sort of autopilot. I can function. I can do all of the things I need to do around the house. I can even edit videos. You'll probably notice there's been a few videos occurring regarding Witcher 3 modding. And I released my own mod. I've actually been working on that for over a week. I've been spending quite a lot of time researching it, looking through it, testing things out, sending things back and forth with the developers. Um, well, with regards to their own tutorial, that type of thing. And I'm able to do that even when I'm exhausted through sleep deprivation. But I'm not exactly chipper and chatty. So believe it or not, the toughest things last week, the toughest things for me, were where I was trying to play the Let's Plays. It took an awful lot of coffee and um, self-motivation to get some energy going <laughs> because of sleep deprivation. And the same is true of evening streams. So there you go. Fallout Shelter is now on Android. Yes, I need to get myself an Android simulator for my PC. Sorry, emulator, not simulator, an emulator. Can't be a simulator, simulators won't work. I need an emulator. Um, and then I can play Fallout Shelter and perhaps stream that. I do know there are a few simulators. I'm assuming there's an Android emulator as well that will allow me to log in to the uh, Google Store and get that particular app. Blue Stack. All right, I will check it out. I will check it out. Why not just take a break for a few days? Well, the thing is, is I, I kind of would have taken a break, except for the fact that I knew the Witcher 3 modding tools were coming out and was preparing for it. And that is that is the problem now, of course. Um, I may be my own boss, but I'm kind of at the whim of what is going on. I mean, let's face it, if I get the bubonic plague the day before Fallout 4 comes out, I will still be bloody playing, streaming, and recording regardless. I mean, my, my tongue could shrivel up and my hands fall off. I'll be smashing the keyboard with my forehead and moving the mouse with the stumps on the end of my arms because that's pretty much what I'm doing now. So, yes. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, I, I mean, it is, it's, it's a funny old uh, job now. I am my own boss. I can pick my own hours, although usually I pick all of them. Um, 
So, yeah. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully I will get into a more of a rhythm. I'm actually expecting Fallout 4 might be good for me to get me into a rhythm because obviously Fallout 4 will be a major thing. I've already warned my girlfriend that the month after Fallout 4 is going to be kind of hectic, but I'm hoping after that it will, it will get into a semblance of rhythm um, and uh, I will be able to get, get a routine going, which will be nice. So, anyway, enough of that. We can talk about that whilst I dig sand. No, I won't be digging sand today. No, no, we're, we're trying to... We were trying to decide choice of roof. Do you remember? We were trying to decide what to do about the old roof. I thought I was going to go for brick tiles and then maybe something different in the middle. Oh, God. Mighty Crumb Resub. Thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah, I heard about the Fallout 4 um, footage being leaked to Pornhub, and you know what? I'm not actually searching for it. People, people never believe it when you say things like that. Yes, I know there were leaked naked photos of her, but I decided not to search for it because because I, uh, it's not fair. But it honestly, actually, I'm serious. I've resisted the urge to look at it. This is footage they didn't want us to see, so I'm not going to watch it. Call me crazy, call me nuts, but, um... Are they stand up? I've got sto stone slabs. Oh, they've removed it. Ah, well, there you go. Fair enough. Scuba. Oh, welcome, Scuba. We got a new sub. I, I've never, I didn't do a video about it actually. Um, there was footage released of the Fallout for combat and some of the exploration. And I was going to make a video about it actually because I was really impressed with the way the combat looked. I really was. I, I thought the combat looked pretty damned fluid for a Fallout game. I mean, let's face it, Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas were very clumsy as an FPS game. And people go, it's not an FPS, it's an RPG. It can be both. Shut up. Nobody likes a smart ass. Unless he's amusing. And you're not. So stop it. I, um... You know, as an FPS, Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas kind of failed. They did. They, they, they don't move well, they don't react well, and, and FPS gamers will know exactly what I'm talking about. The art of FPS gaming, it's very much about the feel of the damned thing. I need more stone. Do I have stone? Polished. Cobblestone. I don't have stone. Probably going to need some stone and make some stone bricks. How about granite? Might be a good contrast. Might be, might be, might be, maybe. Who knows? Well, we're gonna, well, we're gonna, we're gonna have a try. We're gonna have a play. We're gonna have a see. I'll break it out. Nether brick. The only thing I was thinking was, was have something different in the middle. You see. Although I actually suspect I should make it one more thick. Fallout games are not FPS games with RPGs with FP elements. No, they're RPGs and FPSs. Um, sorry. Uh, and and this isn't my opinion. It, that is a simple statement of fact. You are, you are incorrect if you think otherwise. So there you go. How does it feel to be incorrect? <laughs> it's going to annoy him, isn't it? But you are. Sorry. It's, uh, it's how it is. Because, as I said, you, you don't actually get to have an opinion on a statement of fact. Um... Right, what, what do I want to do? Is it cobblestone to make st No, how do I make st Welcome, Walter Minutus. You're fine being incorrect. Well, that's good. Um, yeah, no, um, FPS means first-person shooter. That is all it means. It means nothing else. 
How do I make brick? How do I make stone? I can't remember how to make bloody polished stone. I thought I, I thought that's how I did it. I thought it was like, bang, and then and then. No. How do you make polished stone? Sunny. Two times two stone equals stone bricks. Yeah, but all right, but I, I need to make stone. I've forgotten how to make bloody stone. That's the problem. The, the most smelt cobble plate. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to place. Oh. What was I doing? Was I putting the wrong thing in there? Cobblestone, cobblestone. Co was I putting the wrong thing in? Am I might be interested like an epic doofus? I probably am. I'm probably being just like an epic doofus. Ignore me. Totally ignore me. No idea what's going on. I, I said I'd had some sleep and was doing fine, didn't I? Perhaps I lied. Perhaps I did. Yes, indeed. I was not waiting. Oh, right. I was being bloody impatient. How dared I? How dare... Welcome, Arg. An oddly appropriate name. Yes, indeed. Um, okay, let's keep some cobblestone. You never know, we might need it. But let's make an awful lot more stone. So, what was I saying? What was I saying? Um, yeah, FPS. It means first-person shooter. Any game where you shoot from first-person perspective is, by definition, a first-person shooter. To which people are going to be like, ah, but FPS is also a genre. Yes. So is role-playing. Uh, so, games can be FPS games and also be flagged as role-playing, although you might not call it a genre. Um, you might say, oh, this one belongs to the FPS genre. And this is one of the major problems with people who like to label things. Oh, this is true of all walks of life, not just gaming. If you, if you like to label things into nice, neat categories, things will come along that defy those categories and want to sit in multiple. And I'm afraid this is one of them. So, yeah. However, as I was saying... As I was, as I was saying... Um, the FPS side of the Fallout games was epically bad. Yeah, it was. It just it didn't feel fluid. It didn't feel good. It didn't have um, that kind of, you know, the nice feeling you get in, when you're playing games like Counter-Strike, um, Team Fortress 2, Quake, those things. Games that were designed to be pure FPS games. But there are plenty of games out there that are not designed to be pure FPS games where they still do FPS mechanics pretty damned well. These include some stealth games, heist games, and even RPGs. And Fallout, unfortunately, was not one of them. But from what I can see of the new Fallout 4 footage, it seems to be a little better. It, it just looked a little smoother, a little nicer. I can't quite put my finger on why I feel that. Um, of course, feel free to say it's because I'm bloody hopeful. Um, and you would also be correct. Um, but I just do. I, 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 I think it looked better. Anyway, that, that's what I was working up to, wasn't it? Yes. So what do you think? Is, is, is this a... Is this a this a viable way of doing it? If it's not great, modders will fix it. Well, they will and they won't. Man, now this, you see, you know, modders can do an awful lot, but there are limits with the engine. And what makes a good FPS game, or what makes a game good at the FPS part of it comes down to how it moves. It's one of the things I said when testing out Killing Floor 2. Killing Floor 2 is kind of cool, but it, 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 it felt a bit odd. Alright, that doesn't work, does it? Look at that. Look at that. No, it doesn't. That does not bloody work. I 
kind of want it to sort of look different over that bit. I think I think that's I think that's what we're going for. Oh god. Give it me. R really? <sighs> really annoying, wasn't it? This is slightly annoying. Right, let's have a look. We've probably got a bit more stone now. And... Yes, nice. So that's, that's one option, you see. To have... It broke up a little. Square of glowstone around the white. Interesting idea. What an interesting idea. That is kind of an interesting idea. Oh, God. Oh, God, did that. Come here. annoying, wasn't it? Okay, um, right, do I want... I could do tile like that, maybe, make it make a little different, so the alcoves are tiny different. You know? No, 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 no. I'm almost tempted to actually leave the, uh, that, that roof a little raised sort of thing there. Oh, who's that, who's that, who's that? Chornus, welcome to the resub. Maybe keep it so it actually is a little raised there, actually. Make it look a little special. So somebody suggested glowstone. This would remove the need. F oh, I don't think I can do that. Oh, can you believe that? It's, it's, it's really going to stay there, isn't it, that one piece? 147 from Mod Creepers into... <laughs> okay, tell you what, we've got to get someone to do that then, haven't we? We've we got to convince somebody to Mod Creepers into Fallout 4. I like that suggestion, I do. I like your thinking. Even if it was an evil thought, and it was. Oh, God, come on. Really? You know. It's kind of nice knowing that there's a, an extra layer between... Uh... So, I don't actually necessarily think this is going to... Okay. No. That's... No. It, it's going to stick down like that. Oh, God, I need to, I need to remember to use my... Silk touch pick to take that. I, I mean, I don't think so. It's going to come down. Although, could that work having it stick out a little like that? Hmm. I mean, a sort of a glowy, a glowstone layer around, and then I, and then I could kind of. I could kind of move. Um, I could kind of move uh, all the all the torches away, couldn't I? I wouldn't need torches anymore. No, it's awful. Eh? Okay. Yeah, I think you're right. It was a thought. Um. We could make the we could actually make the um, the well out of glowstone. Total gl no, that would be awful as well, wouldn't it? <laughs> that would be. T oh, would it? Or 
Thoughts, 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 thoughts. Okay, I'm um, just doing that because I might be destroying it. Oh, I didn't destroy it. That's nice. I, I, was it? Thank you for the resub, Kato. Eh? Eh? <laughs> How about that? I like that. Softly glowing light. I mean, we could actually put glowstone in the walls as well, instead of torches, to make it look... I mean, the torches make it look dungeon-ish, which is kind of nice. Yes, it's a word. Yeah, I thought about granite as well. Can we do granite slabs? I believe we can. I did think about granite, but but honestly, I, I think... I always think you should have... Um, Well, you, you should you should generally stick to two colours, I think, not including black and white. In this room, what we've got is brown. That's definitely one colour, brown. And the other colour now is um, blue with the water. I think red would be too much. See, we've got granite up here. And that's okay, because this is, this, is, this is brown and granite. I suppose granite is like a reddy brown. Yeah, Qu quartz. Would quartz look nice? All right. Okay. Okay. I'm. 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 I. I bite. I bite. Yes, I do. I am on the hook. What can I do with? What can I do with nether quartz? I can make quartz blocks. I can make quartz blocks. A quartz blocks. Nice. Are they nice? Sound nice. Press U on it. I've pressed U. Oh, ooh, ooh, look at it. Daylight sensor. Ah, ah, yes, no. You see, see, I want to save some quartz. Oh, I can make granite with it. I want to save some quartz for a couple of things. I don't want to use all my quartz because daylight sensors are something I definitely want. However, um, we can make some quartz blocks, I suppose. 16 of them and use them for something. Let's see, you on this one. Right, I can make quartz stairs and quartz slabs and pillar quartz blocks. What the hell's a pillar quartz block? Okay, but I can make quartz slabs. There's tons of it in the nether. Yes, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Right, so I can make... Let's try... So you're the other... But where? In the center, maybe? Instead of the stone? Or maybe as an as a as a surrounding the stone. I don't know. Use them for the pool. Oh you mean you Ah, okay. Um, you mean like that? You mean... Aha. Okay. Uh, let's just do the ones that are not going to mess my place up. Not releasing Red Kit Editor. Uh, yeah, I don't know about the Red Kit Editor. I do know they've said they're not planning on it, but I'm hoping they change their mind. Uh, it's difficult to know for sure. 
Oh! Oh, well, that's... That's ruined that particular water. Or does it? No, it, no, it doesn't. We'll clean up the mess later. Tell you what, let's just... We don't want to do two at once, because I'm not totally sure what that does to... Oh. Did I just hear... I think I heard an Enderman. I really did. I did! I did! I heard him. Okay, so now we've got quartz for the pool. This is the worst lava tower ever. Oh, sorry, you, th you, you thought you were being funny. Um, yeah. Um, so... I sort of feel like then I should have a quartz floor. I kind of feel like it needs a quartz floor then. Call me crazy, but, or I could rep quartz in the f ceiling as well, so they kind of match. It looks good for a proper pool. I mean, like, like, what I should do is, is completely replace this with quartz. I mean, that's what I should do. I should make a bloody quartz pool down here. Did I see someone say redstone miniguns? Make the corners touch the ceiling. Okay, it was an interesting idea, actually. You mean go up to the stair? Yeah, I suppose it would, but it would make the room look a little cluttered, to be honest. Maybe the corners of the pool could be something else. I, I don't know, this is not, I'm not. I like quartz. I'm liking the quartz. I don't think it works well in... Now, can I just ask one thing? It's not going to, like, totally... It doesn't break, does it? I still pick it up. Yeah, I do, right? I don't think it works in my crafting room. It's it's the wrong room for it. This is a crafting room. I think, I think brick just looks more functional. I... I just... Oh, that diamond pick is serious. And just... Now, I, I do like quartz. I like the quartz idea. I like the quartz idea, right? Try quartz stairs for the pool. Yeah, I, I, I think you might be right here. That... Put some quartz steps in, have a proper... Or did you mean... Wait a minute. Did you mean drop the pool into the ground and have a quartz area and then... No, right. Here's the thing. This is not a bloody sauna, right? This is not a sauna. This is not for sitting here getting all... This is this is my crafting room and it's, it's an endless supply of water for crafting reasons, right? Let's not mix our pleasures here. What I might do is put another way down here that goes straight to the actual pool. Because we've got this, which is an, a, a real pool. Mind you, this was actually here when I got here. Completely natural pool, believe it or not. Totally weird, totally weird. Um, but then I kind of feel like I should wall this off from my mine. Or, I mean, of course I could, Simply move the mine stairs there and somehow go down that way. I could, I could probably have it. Oh god! I could probably have it so that that uh, it turned up there, turned back, and came out here for the mine, and then have a pool. Yeah, I don't know. I actually think it would be better than for me to have a different. Exit to the pool. Anyway, you know what? I didn't come here to discuss making pools. I like this. This'll do. This will do. And I think... 
Let's have a look at the light levels. I think the light levels are fine. Every, there's a seven. There's a seven right here. This, this is with the darkest spot. But the glowstone seems to be doing its job. And it, it actually has less clutter, which is nice. And uh, I can now, you know what, I think that's probably... Probably quite enough um, stone. Yep. And I can probably put some of this sand back in here to be on the go. Okay, so that's got my sand going. Quartz blocks. Definitely interesting. Definitely interesting. Stone. I got a lot of stone now. What's that? What? Stairs side of the pool. Stairs side of the pool. You, you, you're losing me a little bit. If, you, if I, I, don't, I don't quite understand what you mean by stairs side of the pool. This pool? Or... Or... This pool, and by stairs side, you mean you mean this side of the pool because the stairs are here, or do you mean put stairs down the side of the pool? Because I actually think I actually think if I want to make this a proper pool room, like like a bathing, you know what? No, this is my underground pool. This is my underground. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep fish in there or something. You know what we're gonna do? We you know what we're gonna do with the quartz. You know what we're gonna do with the quartz? We're going to build an outdoor pool. Because who doesn't love an outdoor pool? We can build it here. See, I've got this little thing here. I can, I can, I can extend this. Right, I can put stone all the way here and here. And then quartz maybe here. Yeah, I want grass still. Oh, I don't know. I, need, I want a bigger pool. I want a big bloody pool. I want a pool that's bigger than that. Yes, I do. Um, I don't know, actually. Now I'm... Now I'm roof, roof pool. Roof pool. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, liking it. So instead of a... Instead of a... Right... Brilliant. Brilliant. I like it, but I'm going to need another set of stairs going up there. I'm going to need a stairs. We're going to have a roof pool. We're going to, we're going to have a roof bloody pool, but then we're going to need another set of stairs getting up here. I'm going to need to build an extension on my house. Oh, no! No, no! I don't need this balcony. No, I don't need the bloody balcony. What I can do is destroy the balcony, destroy the balcony, and have a set of stairs coming... I can actually move the entire bedroom a little over. Have a stair... Move the door here. Have You come out, you hit some stairs, you come round, you go up. Like that. And I can make it a glass as well. I can do that. I can do that. But we're going to do that a different day. We're definitely going to do that a different day. Now, we're really, 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 totally and utterly getting too many projects on the bloody go. Yes, we are. Way too many projects on the go at once. Let's try to focus just a tiny bit. Not too much, but a little bit, you know? Probably don't need that where I'm going. I will need the diamonds. Okay. Um, where are the where are the bloody sticks? Really, I have no sticks. What sort of Minecraft player has no sticks pre-made? I mean, uh, just. I mean, how how, how do you not have sticks made? Okay, um, and, um...
So if I have a diamond of efficiency, that would require three. I like it. I like it. I did wonder whether it was actually a good idea. That would take 11. I know but the way this works, though, is each time you repair it, it, uh, it, it Yeah, the thing is, is unbreaking and efficiency. The stupid thing is, is the thing's so goddamn efficient, I, I often wonder whether it's worth it, but there we go. <laughs> I mean, really, I think diamond spade is a little OTT. Exolate, same reason YouTubers advertise in other people's comment sections. What? What? I don't advertise in other people's comment sections. Do I? Who's that? We're not talking about me, are we? We're not talking to me or about me. I'm being completely ignored. Yes, I am. My chat are talking about completely other things. Totally ignoring me. It's as if I don't exist. And I just realized I should probably save a little sand just in... Oh, God, no. no what are you doing? Wrong. Wrong. Well, that one's all been used. Just in case I need to make some sandstone. And you know I'm probably going to. Got nothing to do with me. Yeah. My, uh, just, you just, you're paying me no attention, basically. I may well go into the garden and eat worms. A few older English people will probably get the reference. The rest will scratch their heads. So, this is the whole sand thing. The whole sand thing. This is what this was about, if you remember. Also, I've been trying to have some ideas. It happens occasionally. Right, with sandstone. So I'm going to put sand in with the sandstone. Uh, uh, I'll put the glass in there. Yes, I will. Why not? I'll keep some of it. Going to need some of it. Right. Um, so, thoughts. Next thought is I wish I hadn't built so high up in here. Um, because I'm trying to think of a way to get the lava to flow here and then... To go round, basically. And I, and I came up with some interesting ideas. But I'm not a hundred percent sure whether they'll work. Um, I have to. I have to. The sandstone will not burn, will it? It won't burn. Because I could remove some blocks. You see. What I was thinking was, when the lava hits here, if the blocks above it, the ones there and there, are actually open. The lava will flow out and then flow over and then go sideways. And I'm wondering whether I could get it back in. No, you know what? That's just going to be too bloody complicated. It really is. I was trying to think of some sort of valve system where I could split the lava and it goes both ways. But it would have to be in there, I think. Or would it? No, it would have to drop the lava down here. You'd be able to touch it. I would need a few, I'd need an extra gap. I would need an extra gap. So my original plan of actually having it here is, is going to be the way forward. Other ideas though, somebody came up with an idea of using pistons. So right underneath the door here, I actually have a piston, I have lava placed in, in, in a block all by itself that doesn't flow. And then I have a piston that pushes it out or pushes it up maybe. But then it'd be big and ugly and look, you'd be able to see it for miles. Don't like that idea either. So, uh, in which case, let's get back on the uh, on the job. On the job. And we have to have, we should, we should have a straw poll. What is more boring, watching me build a lava tower or watching me dig up? I really do need more sandstone. I do need more sandstone. Watching me dig up sand. Yep, we should definitely have a, uh, a straw pole for it. I'm going to need sandstone. I am going to need sandstone. Aren't I? 
pretty much like now. Okay, and 42, the place for the first of the... Uh, Exits, good God, is here. I'm still not completely sure I, I, I think 42 is a good idea. I, I know it's a great number. I do know it's a great... You didn't install inventory tweaks, did you? No. Was I supposed to? Right, no, but right, here's the thing. I was originally thinking I'd have lots of these little platforms, so you go out and you can look from a certain height. But then it occurred to me, I'm never going to want to do that. I really am not. So... Let's have a look. Joking because I love. Um, yes, you may post it. Jo I know. It's just. It's, uh... Okay. Goose boosh. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. I got a bit of momentum there, didn't I? You see. It looks high up from up there, but it doesn't look that high up from here. So, obviously, I'm going to have a platform at the very top to look out of. And I was thinking, maybe all I need is one other tower platform to look out of. Which would mean, instead of 42, it would have to be 84. Cinematic camera. Oh, God. Uh, what, what, what? What was the F something or other, right? We don't have bullet time, though, you know. <laughs> Welcome, Telif Nisimon. Uh, okay. Oh, God, this is so awesome. So. Well, you have actually got a straw pole. Where is it? Okay, let me have a look. You actually put a straw pole up. What is more interesting? Digging sand, building a lava tower. Building a lava tower is winning. Yes, it is. Okay, brilliant. Kind of glad. Oh, who's that? Who's that? Thank you for the resub. Switch PB. Yeah, well, anyway, what's the thing? So, I don't know. I kind of feel like. If I plan on making what will essentially be three intermediate platforms and then the top one, it's going to take twice as long, and I'm not totally sure it will actually look any more impressive. Um, let me let me show you what I mean. I have to do it from the house, and it might even look a little messy. But I don't know. It's it's difficult to say. It really is very very difficult to say. But it is, it's obviously a lot more complicated. So, right now, we're talking about having another platform there. So we'd have one here, one there, then probably one there, then another one there. Oh, there, one there. Then another one there, and then finally one right at the top. So the question is, is will that look a little cluttered? Because these platforms are going to be thicker than you think. They're going to be a few blocks thick. Or would it be better to have the next platform there? In fact, it won't just be the next platform. It would be the only intermediate platform. You'd have this platform on the base. Then you'd have one at 84 up, which would be there. So that would be there. And then finally, one twice as tall as that, which would be the very top of the sky, essentially. So that would be two platforms. Because, honestly, I, I really almost don't see the point of multiple platforms, because you, you're either going to go to the very, very top, or maybe 
the halfway. One platform in the middle, one at the top. I, it's what, that's my instinct. That's my instinct. So... People are not impressed with phallic buildings anymore. It's not supposed to be a phallic building. It, it's... Whatever. So here's this is this is baseline and the Y was 63, which means the other one will be 107, right? 107. Good. Please talk about TV movies. Okay. Um, why? <laughs> Thanks for the tip, but but why? So this should be 107 if I got got everything right. No, 105. Well, I messed that up, didn't I? I really did. Oh, no, wait, 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 just a damned minute. I probably did this from the wooden platform, didn't I? Which I shouldn't do. I shouldn't have done. But I probably did. Oh, no, it is the wooden platform. What am I talking about? Wait a minute. 63. Plus 42, oh, 42 should be 105. Was it 105? Did I just get distracted by that tip? Was it 105? Okay, I'm so going to fall off. Okay. Yes, you know, it was 105, 105. Okay, so what I really need to do is keep going up until 147. 147, that should be a better number to remember. Okay, 147 it is, and, there, and therefore we need to keep building upwards. Um, I'm trying to remember, what was the middle made out of? Smooth, yeah, smooth, right. So we're going up till 147. And, uh, yeah, I've got to try and remember what the hell I'm doing. Which I know is not easy. That was it, wasn't it? We, all, we had one more, then... Like so. Yeah, that's how we're doing this. Yeah, so we're back to this again. <laughs> oh my god, that's high up. That really is high up, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, it is. <laughs> dear, oh dear. Oh! <laughs> what the hell am I... I'm... Tell you what, don't build and read chat at the same time. <laughs> I'm trying to read chat. Tomorrow I'm going to Zakithos. What? I have no idea what's going on. Which is actually the normal state of the stream. I should really give up trying to make sense of it, shouldn't I? My life would become a little simpler if I stopped trying to make sense of the stream. I don't know again. No, 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 that's right. Oh, God. Play Hawken. It's free. Uh, why does that name ring a bell, kind of? Thank you for the tip. Uh, I'm not sure I'll do that, though. I have a lot of games that weren't free <laughs> that I still haven't played. And games that are free that I haven't played as well. I mean... But thank you for the suggestion. I'm not saying I won't play it, actually. I'm just saying it's, it's you know. I'll have to put it on the th list of things to do, which is pretty close to saying that I don't have time. You know, unless, like, Fallout 4 gets cancelled or something. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> just, 
<laughs> oh, just think of that. Could you just imagine that? Imagine that happening. Just, just do it. I said, imagine it. Stop trying to resist and imagine it. <laughs> Obviously, they wouldn't be like it wouldn't be Rick rolling, but let's just say they got there and it like no, we we we, we wanted to release it, and then we found out we'd accidentally used assets from Batman Arkham Asylum or some I don't know whatever, and uh, uh, was it Warner Brothers? They said they're going to sue us, and that's it. We, we we're going to have to go back and start again. Oh God, I'm at fail mode engaged. Okay. Why am I telling horror stories at night? <laughs> hey, I don't know. I, I I remember when I made. Um, do you remember the old the actual hoax? Um. Oh. Oh, seem to be out of sandstone. Oh, good God. Um, and torches. We should put torches. Right, we've got one there. One here. Do you remember the whole um, hoax thing, right? And I made a joke video before we knew it was a hoax. It was just a joke video where I joked that it was a hoax. Um, and I got grief for that. <laughs> I... Huh. I want that. Um. Okay. Huh. Oh, shh. Cow. I'm alive, though. Don't worry. I have boots of prevent stupidity death. God damn it. How did I fail that jump? Don't know, but I did. Okay, you know what? Ha <laughs> Yes. How did I survive? I have, uh, I have, um, de no, uh, feather falling four. I have enchanted boots. <laughs> you evil people. You were hoping for death. I am pushing my luck, though, aren't I? As this gets taller, I think once I get to about halfway up, if I do that, I am going to die. <laughs> there, is, there, is, there is no way I'm surviving that too many times. Which is unfortunate. Um, right, so sandstone. And yes, I hate using sand for that, knowing I'm going to have to go and do... I just don't have enough sand stuff. This is really... I'm going to need a lot more sand. I, I may have made a mistake in not... in using all of this. I've definitely made it... I need to go and rescue some of that sand because I need sandstone. Put a couple of blocks of water there. That would be cheating. Plus it would flood the basement. I need to go on ham radio podcast. You're not talking about real ham radio, are you? You're talking about something completely different. Yeah, we, we got a lot of glass now. I think actually I'm going Good you did. Two dollars from Anonymous, thank you very much. So what's ham radio broadcast? Fallout podcast. Oh, yeah, I don't mind. But nobody's invited me on one, so it'd be rude of me to invite myself, wouldn't it? Scary spray. Oh, God. Tactical board breaks. What then? Well, it's game over then, isn't it, really? I just have to find a new job. Um... Well, I actually have had a few people offer to send me spare ones, but I don't actually have like a PO box or set up or anything so people can send me stuff. I keep trying to get one, 
But Norway may be the hardest country to do anything beyond eating and sleeping. It's really just not easy. I'd like a PO box, please. You need to fill in this form and apply for the 12 forms that you need to fill in. After that, you will need a proof of identity plus 12 more forms. And then, of course, the obligatory catalogue book of forms, which we then beat you to death with. If you still want a PO box after that, you can have one. I guess it's just to, like, weed out the people who really, really don't want it. Um, so anyway, what was, what was the question? Tactical board. Um, so yeah. So either somebody will send me an old archived one and I can carry on playing, or I'll have to buy another type of gaming keyboard, preferably a small one, probably something designed for a laptop. Oh, welcome back, Viper Maggie. Um, for, um, for the purposes of playing. Did I get that right? I think I did. There are some keyboards that look like I would be able to use them at the same, you know, uh, and have the, my hands closer together. Um, you know, but, um, I'd have to try them out. I would probably get used to them, although I have to tell you, I haven't seen a keyboard with particularly impressive, uh, what you, I would call arrow keys, they're all tiny little things. They're like the same size as the keyboard, the keys on the normal keyboard, which to me is just horrible. But hey. I could use a controller. Okay, take that man outside and slowly beat him to death. Thank you. Um... I do use controller for things that don't require aim. Um, no, I use controller for when I'm taking video footage of certain things for smooth movement, because it's kind of better, easier to do smooth movement. And certain games, Mark the Ninja was one of those games that just felt better with um, the controller. But I, I wouldn't use any first person... I wouldn't use a controller for any first person game, because that would just be bloody horrible. Really bloody horrible. And I would lose, I would just lose all credibility in the eyes of anybody in the FPS world. I mean, pfft. God damn it, I've actually run out. I've actually bloody run out. I have, I've run out. Oh God, I know where, oh God, nearly, nearly ran off the edge. I know where there are some slabs. I've run out of slabs. I wanted to get up. To the, to the level I was going to get up, but it looks like I'm going to have to go sand fishing again. Uh, before I do that, though, maybe I can... No! no come b I kind of wanted to... Oh, thank one. Thanks. Okay, I've got two more. Brilliant. I'm 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 really seriously getting nervous now when I climb up here. Um okay, I'm gonna leave it like that. Uh right, let, let's make sure we put torches. We don't want creepers coming. Torch there, torch there. Alright, um holy how, how tall are we at the moment? How, how far up are we going? We, we, we need 104. Way! We're not far off the halfway point, at least vis a vis stairs. Oh my god. <laughs> um, maybe I should catch up with the glass, actually. I was kind of hoping to get, you know, to the. Oh god, I'm getting, now I'm getting dizzy. Now I'm actually getting bloody dizzy. Make a water pool at the bottom for safety. Hey, what? And remove the excitement. Oh, God. Whew. Okay, I've actually... Oh, God, I don't have enough smooth... Oh, God, no, I really... I don't have enough smooth sandstone either, actually. I'm slightly foobard. I have to... I have to actually go sand um 
mining again. I do. Sorry. I've actually got glass. I lack sandstone now. Oh, I, I, can, I can go a bit. I can, I can, I can level it up a little here. I suppose. Oops. Do, do, do. What website did I get my shaders from? I don't know actually. Um, basically Google. That's what I did. I googled it. So, if I was to answer your question, I would simply Google say your shaders, and I suppose you can pretty much do the same. <laughs> and I don't mean that in a nasty way. I don't mean that in the usual way. Ooh. So, uh, yeah, I've got one more block I can use on each of these corners, and then we're as, uh, we're as done as we can be without going for a bit of a sand shoveling experience. Sorry about that. I, I completely forgot about uh, needing... needing sandstone. I don't need as much sandstone as I need sand, but um, I do need it. Make the pool first. No! No! No, 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 no. I'm not getting distracted by making a bloody pool. Sorry. I appreciate digging sand may be the most boring thing on the face of the planet. I do. I understand completely. But that's part of Minecraft. I'm going to have to increase my uh, view distance. I really am. And the other thing is, is I sort of don't want to fill the bloody tower with lava. I almost wish I had only just done a simple tower. A simple glass tower that went up to the sky made of glass. Because A, I'd already be at the top. If, if, I, if I saved all of the glass from the outside wall, I'd be at the top by now. But it wouldn't be as impressive, would it, as a lava tower. But I just like seeing the world. So, um, yeah, uh, that's, um, I'm going to leave my silk touch pick here because, and, um, let's go get my map. Let's go get my map. Or maybe just stripes of lava. Maybe. Could have used glass panes. Uh, glass panes are not going to hold lava inside. Besides, the way the lava flows, it would have left a gap around the glass panes and it would have looked really daft. It'd be, I could have done the same here. Um, and the, the water would not have touched the glass. It would have been held... It would have been held away by a sort of a invisible force. Like this little gap here. Quick boat trip with compass. Oh, I don't need a boat. Who needs a boat? Why would I need a boat? I'm going to be spending my entire time under bloody water. I don't need a boat for that, do I? No, I don't. <laughs> Might need to... Where was my map? Which was, which was the right map? This one. See, we've got an entire area, but, but we actually had... Oh. I, I, I have a little sand. I could, uh, just let that finish off. We got more. I've got a little more sand, haven't I? I've got a little more sand. Let's just carry on a little bit. Let's carry on a little bit. We got more sand. Have I got sandstone in one of the chests? Someone says I've got sandstone in the chests. We may be saved. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we may be saved from the underwater perils of sand boredom. Yes, it's a thing. It's documented in all the latest scientific journals. Underwater sand boredom. Very perilous. You lied to me. You lied to me. I should never forgive you. Well, I might. Okay, you're already forgiven. Right, um, so, I should probably eat. So excited, I missed the stairs. See, it looks even good with torches. Can we straw pole to either find a desert or dig sand? Yeah, you use straw pole it. I am going to ignore said straw pole and go and dig sand. I don't want to find a desert. Well, it's not that I don't want to find a desert. It's on my list of things to do. It's just below build a bloody sa uh, glass lava tower. That's all. It's not, it's not, it's not, you know, it's not that I don't like deserts. I've got nothing against deserts. Deserts are very nice. I just, um... That's not what we're going for right now. Okay? Just... That's how it is. Now, what was it I needed? Um... I got some stairs. I need... Yes, those. Excellent. Probably going to wrap. Probably going to. Oh God! No, it wasn't those. It was smooth, bloody sand. Oh God! Fine. We're going to just. We're going. Yeah. No. It wasn't those. It was smooth, bloody sand. Oh, okay. Can I break it down in the sand? No. God damn it. See, this is because you made a straw pole. Blame philosopher cat. Okay, I like it. Peacat, it's all your fault. How dare you? Um. See, if you hadn't made me do the straw, think about the straw pole, and by think about it, I mean reject it out of hand. I, I would have remembered what the hell I was doing. So what was I doing? I was going to hunt for sand. Yes, I was. And I got everything I need. I've got a map, but I don't actually have a compass. Believe it or not, I don't have a compass. Should I bring a compass as well? Just in case I go out of map range? I probably should. I probably should. Okay, I got a compass, and I got a map, just in case I go off the map. Come prepared. Yes. Text you back. How long has the stream been going? Oh, the stream has been going um, just over an hour. Actually, that's a very good point. Well reminded. You know what? It's time to have a break. Let's close the door. Oh, we could get a horrible Enderman, couldn't we? Um, no, you know what? It's my bloody house. I'm going to have a break here. Protected from the rain, and if an Enderman comes, I shall be very dischuffed with it. Okay, uh, five minute break. I will see you soon. I saw somebody say, Rebel against the Moobot. Nobody rebels against Moobot. Ha 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 ha. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> oh. It's amazing what a couple of nights sleep does to my mood. <laughs> yes indeed.
So, here we go. Carrying on. Why do I not have sound? Why don't I have sound? Oh, because... There goes sound when you jump, that's why. And apparently there's no music. Hello, world... My... God, that thing really does stand out, doesn't it? It's going to be awesome. Right, so, we need sand. And somebody actually said, what I should do is turn the sand into sandstone and even smooth sandstone. I don't think smooth sandstone's needed, but sandstone, um, while I'm... Are you kidding me? Really? I will find you and I will insert this dirt in places you just... You're going to need a bloody Enderman pearl to get them out. God damn stupid bloody Enderman. <sighs> nope. Nobody told me they can actually put dirt. <laughs> I'm going to come, come here one day and find my doorway bricked up or something. God damn it. Stupid... Stop saying yes indeed. No. Stop telling me what to say. Thank you for the tip, by the way. <laughs> Thank you for the tip. And no. Stop telling me what to bloody well do. Yeah, my God, you say brilliant too much. And? Why is there rotting meat and seeds here? Like a zombie had a fight with a chicken. Okay. Must be new here. Right, so. Past. Hey, every little bit counts. And you can't see that from my house, so it's not ruining. Shut up. Who is there? Enderman is public enemy number one. Kind of is, isn't he? At least the creeper just blows stuff up. You know what I'm saying? He's annoying. Really annoying. But the Enderman, why what, what is that? I'm going to steal one bit of dirt. Why? Why would you do that? And why would you put one right there? Does that grass look a little different to you? Like... That looks darker green than this or something. I, I mean, it, it, it's just... It's actually just soil, right? I mean, it is. It, it's just soil. Let's put it back. Now, um... That is back to where I spawned, so... Head there if I get lost from the map. I'm not going to get lost, contrary to what everyone thinks. Okay, and this was... Was this clay or sand or both? That's clay. Yeah, some people think I should take this as well, but we're not on the hunt for clay. No, we're not. Do I ever think I will get... I'm not even here and they're blowing things up. Really? Really? Mm. <sighs> I mean, they just really... No, jump again, jump. Nice, there you go. Um, 
Me, you, you can now hop. See? You're welcome. And uh, let me just fix that. Because they really are annoying, aren't they? Yep, there you go. Well done. Welcome, Lemke, Clay. Welcome, Lemke144. Oh, the music. Yes, indeed. And the sun's going down. Of course it is. Of course it is. Why couldn't it come up? Is there a kind of music for it? Now, I do remember, I say I remember, there, there was some sand over there, wasn't there? I sort of seem to have forgotten it. I've forgotten where it is. I'm sure I will find it again. Could I go? Why am I not going up? Ah, lily pad. Clay? Yep, clay. Probably going to pick a lot of that up. No point throwing it down. Let's head more in that direction. Almost certainly clay. I have a feeling there was some sand over there, you see. There's some sand. No, that's clay. That's clay. That is definitely clay. Am I missing something? Looks like I'm missing some sand. Thank you very much. And sand, where the hell are we now? Hmm. And yet, did I miss... I missed a whole bank of sand. Is this clay or sand? No, no, that's sand. That sounded like sand, didn't it? Yes, that sounded like sand. So. That's clay. But it was kind of in the... Okay. Destroying too much of the coastline? No, not at all. It'd be a bit steep. It'd be good diving ground. That's clay. That is clay, yes. We're getting lots of clay, a little bit of dirt. There's the sand. Check what I'm destroying up there. Nothing yet. Okay. Who's his favourite Boney M song? Um, Ra Ra Rasputin. Definitely Ra Ra Rasputin. Ooh, I saw something there. Did anyone else see something? Oh my god! I saw a cave. Is it iron? It's iron. I think. Is it iron? I think it's iron. You know what? I need iron. Yes, I do. It's iron. Okay. I broke through to a cave. Um, and I, I don't... I don't actually want to keep that open. No, I don't. Mm. 
There we go. We stopped the flowing water. How are we doing on it? See, it's still not destroyed. You'd never know I was here. No one's going to accuse me of being the man of coming in and destroying the natural beauty while just ravaging them for resources. No, I shall leave the place looking fine. Just ever so slightly less sandy than it was before. Um. Oh, God, no, come here. My sand is running away. My sand is actually running away. It is, it is actually running. Got you. Where are you? I hear you. Russia's greatest love machine? Um, is that a question or, 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 or your name? Um, thank you. <laughs> that was a little odd. Clay, clay, clay. Is this all clay? That looks clayish to me. No, it's not. It's sand. Okay, now I'm beginning to impact the shoreline a teeny bit, aren't I? Yes, I am. Not too much. Not, 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 not too badly, but I am. I'll admit it. I can shave off a little bit there. I, I, I you know, I don't want to destroy it too much. Then uh, I'll take. Oh, you know what? I'm, I'm going to leave it there. Oh, no, wait, what? Is that more sand? That's sand, yes it is! I wish the sun would come up, because this would be a lot easier. I think this is sand. Yeah, that's not going up, so that's sand. Wet Desert Support Fund. Thank you very much. At least somebody realises that this is a desert. Can I have an underwater house? Why can't I have an underwater desert? I w It was the lyrics to Ra Ra Ra. Oh, of course it was. Of course it was. Lover of the Russian Queen. God, yes, yes. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, not really paying any uh, any attention. I actually don't know the lyrics of it. I, I remember Ra 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 between Lover of the Russian Queen, uh, but I, I don't remember the whole thing. I'm not. I'm not actually a walker. Uh, a, a walking encyclopedia of Boney M lyrics. In spite of what you might have thought. <laughs> Thing is, you know, somewhere there is, there's somebody out there who is a complete and utter encyclopedia, specifically of Boney M lyrics. And likewise, there are also people out there right now going, who the hell is Boney M and why am I watching an old man play Minecraft? Don't lie, I know you're thinking it. The next thought would be, why the hell is anyone asking him about Boney M, for God's sake? And the answer to that one is... Jack. My Fallout New Vegas Let's Play. Um, there's a Bible passage that's quoted by one of the characters. But that Bible passage also happens to be the lyrics to a Boney M song called... The rivers of Babylon. The things you learn while playing Minecraft. Well, no. The things you learn while watching somebody else play Minecraft.
I don't want to take too much of this sandbank either. I know, I, I literally, I am the, the world's only environmentalist Minecraft player. I know, it's completely daft. Hey, at least the sun's coming up, right? Okay, I, I don't want to leave that much of, of the sandbank behind. Hey, I, I look at it this way. Maybe I'm doing them a favour. There's, there's, there's people in the neighbourhood who really would like to dive here, but it's just not deep enough. But now, now, it's deep enough. See? I'm doing them a favour, really, aren't I? I'm making a diving pool. As long as they don't accidentally hit the gravel. Maybe we should put a sign up. I now have this strange urge to actually go back, build a sign, and come back here saying, mind the gravel spike. You will bang your head. See, that's not so bad. That's not so bad. Right, now, what people were sort of saying, I think, was um, if, you, if you make the sandstone now, that was literally the worst way of doing that. It was not, not actually the worst way of doing it, but it was pretty close up there. Um, ever fence door shot what sport? Ever fenced, ever fenced or shot what sport? Yes, I have shot. And depends what you mean by fenced. Smooth sandstone. No, actually, smooth sandstone doesn't actually save me space. It doesn't save me space. I can do that when we get back. I can actually do that when we get back. Smooth sandstone and sandstone take up the same amount of space. Yes, they do. Don't need that. Don't need that. Keeping that. Certainly don't want diorite. I don't need more dirt. <sighs> Seeds. Clay. Clay, I guess I'm going to... I don't want more clay, but you know I'm going to keep picking it up. Um, right, anyway, so uh, there you go. We've already got some sandstone. Life is looking sandier. Let's carry on. Morning has risen. No, morning is dawning. The sun has risen. It's daylight. It's kind of what I'm getting at. I'm just trying to make it sound a little more, you know, dramatic. Fencing as in pokey metal things. You mean sort of like, yeah, no. Well, un 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 unless Japanese swords count, then yes. I know, I actually, no, you know what? I tell a lie. I tried um, fencing, like what you're calling fencing. I did try it one time. I think, while at university. Because that's what you do at university, isn't it? You join absolutely every single solitary club known to man. Okay, let's go north. And try not to fall into things. I mean kendo. Well, that is what Japanese fencing is called, so yes. But we don't actually have to use the Japanese word for it, do we? Or, or, or are we those types? <laughs> You're not allowed to call it karate. You've got to call it karate. <laughs> oh, shit. Dude! Whoa. I gotta ask, did you do this big hole? Was this you and your brethren? Because no one's impressed, nobody likes you, stop doing it. Brown sheep, nothing. Oh god, no, almost fell out. Don't go that way, there's a bloody lava pit! Lava pit. St Nobody's in. Oh, oh, nice little little pirouette there. What? What are you? 
Geralt the bloody sheep? What languages you speaks? English. I attempt to speak American occasionally, but I always get told off. Apparently I don't pronounce the words correctly. Beta, for example. I, I've not quite got the hang of saying that correctly. <laughs> oh, that was funny. My first ever uh, Skyrim... Well, not my first ever Skyrim video, I suppose. My first video for Immersive Hood in Skyrim. I used the word beta. And oh my god, did I receive a lot of comments about that. Most of them insulting from people who are too stupid to realise they're stupid. Which is my favourite kind of stupid. I mean, oh hello. See, Sand, hello. Actually, I suppose by definition, really, if you realise you're stupid, you're probably not stupid. I, all stupid is unaware of its stupidity, really, isn't it? In fact, let's face it. Stupidity is only stupid when the person saying it thinks they're actually being very, very clever. Oh my god, you said beta wrong. <laughs> Sorry, beta wrong. <laughs> You're so stupid and I'm so clever. Because that's the other thing. That's one of the things. Whenever, whenever anybody insults anybody on the internet, I always tend to read the opposite. Well, not the opposite. I always tend to infer... Um, that they're implying the opposite about themselves more than anything. It's it's not so much of a, oh my god, Gopher, you're so bad at this game. It's more a, I'm so awesome at it. I do. I think that's what they're trying to do. <laughs> Insults on the internet. Well, we haven't talked about that for a while, have we? It's a lot more fun digging sand when it's sunny, isn't it? <laughs> Go for this educational tonight. What do you mean tonight? What do you mean tonight? That that would imply that I'm not educational every night. That's what you're implying, isn't it? Really? Don't be by the bush. Data, data, and data. Data. Data and data. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do I say? Data, probably. Data. No, data. Database. Yeah, data. Definitely, definitely data. What's... What, 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 in Star Trek, he's called data, isn't he? It's a bit weird if you think about it. It's an American series. Don't you all say data? Which, by the way, sounds like you're saying dada, as in daddy. But like like a baby would say to me, it's just it's just. But I hear that on all a lot of um, American words, when you guys use T's, I hear D's. The, for example, beta. I don't hear you say beta. When I hear an American say it, I hear um, uh, what was it? Uh, beta. I hear I hear a D sound, very very soft T. Although it's even worse here in Norway. There are, there are certain vowels that sound different. They have different ways of saying um, like A and double A or O and double O. And some of them I can hear and some of them are real problems hearing. For example, the word for ceiling and the word for thank you sound remarkably similar to me. <laughs> they're, they're spelt differently, but uh, they sound remarkably similar and, and, and it's sometimes a little confusing. Just try not to say those words. Yeah, words are funny though. I always try not to laugh at people for the way they say words, although occasionally I can't help it. Um, I'm probably going to offend some of my American <laughs> friends here. Um, but um, I always found it hilarious the way um, President Bush used to say terrorist. Uh, because for the life of me, it sounded like he was saying tourist. 
<laughs> it's just that's what it sounded like. Oh, we sounded like he had a war on tourism. <laughs> to me. <laughs> like, what? You mean you don't want me to come and visit? Fine, I won't. It's just the way, you know, terrorists and tourists sound kind of similar, at least when he said it to me. <laughs> uh, yes. No, it's not really politics, it's language, but... Um, What was that? That was Enderman. It was daytime. Oh, you see, sons of Enderman. There we go. Politics ban government. No, it's not politics. It's not politics to talk about the way someone says something, is it? Is it? Really? Fine, ban me. Um... Or, uh, sorry, are you suggesting that even mentioning a politician is politics? Oh, God. Really? Please talk in different accents. Uh, I don't do different accents. Well, I might. I don't do different accents. I think I do different moods or different... Um, yeah, different... See, for example, I, I'll sometimes talk what I would call posh. Um, yeah, I, I would call it posh. But it's it's normally when I'm trying to be... I don't know, it's, it's very difficult. Um... Yeah, yeah, I do it sometimes when I'm playing with Che, or, I, I, you know, we're trying to say, ONWARDS! <laughs> and I just, I, I, I say it in a way I would never dream of saying it in real life. Well, I might say it in real life, but I'd be being humorous. Because there's just, I don't know, I get this urge to say it as though I were uh, some British officer or something like that. And you'll hear me, you'll hear me do things like I will... Sometimes I will not enunciate my words as clearly as others. For example, if I'm trying to be... If I'm trying to be educational, I will enunciate quite a lot, but I will also not emphasise things quite as much. If I'm... If I'm trying to be a little over the top, I will enunciate and be a little... I will exclaim far more. Che does that a lot, actually. I don't know if you noticed, Che does that. Che's a, a natural-born exclaimer. It, 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 in his very greeting, Che's greeting is very, uh, very much an exclamation. What ho! Oh, no, I can't do it. What ho! Presence! You know, he's got this very exclamation. I do that sometimes depending on my mood. So I don't really do dialects, but I do... I, I think I do... I wouldn't say I even do different voices, but I do different inflections and... But that's... I've always been like that. I've always been like that. It's, it's, it's kind of odd that I never ended up in bloody pantomime or something, now that I think about it. I actually always fancied being in pantomime. I don't, I don't know if Americans get pantomime. I'm sure you do. Um, I always, from a very, very early age, always thought it would be so very cool to be in a pantomime as the bad guy. <laughs> don't ask me why the bad guy. I don't know. I just like playing the bad guy. You may have noticed that a few times in some of my Let's Plays. Shut up. Where's he gone? This is for interrupting me. This is for the... Dude, put that bloody dirt down. Fine. Um, what was I saying? Can't have been important, can it? No. And even... So, yeah, with accents and dialects. My accent and dialect change with my mood as well. Um, it also depends who I'm talking to. If I go back to Manchester, of course, I will start talking far more Mancunian. If I visit Liverpool, I would start emulating a little more of the Liverpoolian twang. And, you know, after being back in Norway for any amount of time, I change yet again. But now, of course, most of the talking I do on a day-to-day -day basis is in recordings while playing games, very often pretending to be someone else. He's behind you. Thank you. Um, and thus, for all I know, my... Oh, God, really? Run! Ah! Oh! Could you do that again only when I jump in that direction? Because I really would like to get up there. No? 
Well, I'm sorry about the big hole, but don't take this the wrong way. I really don't care about this place. It looks like nobody's ever going to want to visit. I don't mean to insult your home or anything, but um, I'm going to. Move in that direction. Okay. Still looking for sand and also looking to... Got a double whammy there. Bit of a double whammy. Okay. Jump and jump. <laughs> ah! Rocket jumping a la Creeper style. Marvel or DC. Uh, don't care. Um, it's not that I don't enjoy comics. I do sometimes. But I'm not like... I'm not one of those people who could tell you the difference between Marvel and DC. I'm just not. I'm not that big a nerd, I guess. Okay, which way do I want to go? Um... Actually, no, don't destroy this area. Oh, he didn't explode. Okay. It's a shame, isn't it? Yeah, no, I don't want you to make a hole up here. So, skellies. Right. We've almost filled the map in here. There isn't much of a difference if it's on other comics. Well, there probably is if you're a fan of one of them and someone's probably horribly offended by you just saying that. Because, I, I don't know if you know this, uh, the, uh, the etymology of the word fan is in fact fanatic and some of them do in fact live up to that name and are... What could you stop? No! Okay. Don't you knock me off the bloody mountain. Fly! Alright, we got we got a bit of map up there we haven't actually uh Meh. Transform Transformers? Thank you, Transformers. Um okay. Moves pretty high up, isn't it? Okay. So, we... Have we... I think we filled the map there. We've got a little... No, we haven't. We've got a little spot ahead. Oh, God, really? I don't suppose there's a large pool for me. That looks like it might be water. Yeah, I heard you. Jump! No! Not doing it. Did, did anyone else hear that sheep call me a pussy? Because that's pretty much what I heard. Do you know the Transformers? Well, yes, they were a TV program when I was a kid. I'd, 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 have, to, I'd have to be pretty bloody oblivious to the world not to have heard of the Transformers. They were actually a toy, believe it or not, before they were a cartoon. They were actually a toy before, before they were a cartoon. So was Heat Man and the Masters of the Universe. Many of you probably don't even know what the hell that God, you know what? I don't even... I don't want to fight you. I just want to be left alone while I read my map and figure out where the hell I'm going. <laughs> Because I don't even think I'm going this way. No, I, I'm going round, you see. Yeah, no, I, I, I consider myself a fan of many things. But I use the word in a very different way to the way people who call themselves true fans. You know, you know what that's like. Like, yeah, I, I'm a Fallout fan, but... I'm not a true fan of Fallout by, by their definition because I don't agree with whatever particular interpretation of the law they like. What was that? Ever tried the Hitman games? All of them, actually. All of them. Um, I prefer some of the earlier ones, to be honest. Um, and I was not a big fan of the latest one for some reason. 
it, it had good mechanics and everything. But unless you played... Oh. oh I really don't want to ruin this. Unless you played um, a kind of save scum game, it usually ended up quite a lot of combat. Um, well, the combat was fun. They had a lot of special moves in the latest uh, Hitman game. You could you could lure people around corners and take them down and steal their weapons from them. It was, it was pretty cool. When things went wrong in in, the, in that latest Hitman game, you you could get out of it, but it it went wrong very often. They, they seemed to make it um, I wouldn't say tougher exactly, but uh, more. I need to go in that direction. Yeah, no, I mean, when I say true fans, I am being completely facetious because I don't think they're actually fans of a series at all. Because very often, rather than being fans of something, all they actually are are people who like to have a side. And there are people like that for a, a variety of things, including real life. But they're just people who like to have a side. So I, I know there are people out there who decided they were not going to like Fallout 3 before it was released. Because it wasn't the original developers. Or because it was first person. Or, you know, because... an insert reason. And the same people had decided in advance that they were... Thank you. That they were going to like Fallout New Vegas because it was the original devs or some of the original devs in some capacity type thing. They'd already decided this. Whereas the vast majority of us treat Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas as very similar games with subtly different, well not subtly different styles, but different styles, but both good in their own way, they had categorised these games in advance, in my opinion, just the way they talk. And they would usually pick one or two features that they had decided. I have two TF figures from GC Brin. Oh, thank you, GC Brin. You have two TF fig T TF2 figures. What, like, like dolls? I think I've now explored the area completely and utterly, which was one of the tasks. And we are now literally just looking for sandy areas to exploit. Whoa. So, you get your wish after all. I'm kind of exploring. Well, I'm not exploring. I must have been here before at some point. We've more or less explored this whole map, though, now. It's a pretty big area. God, do you remember when I was coming out here desperately trying to get sheep? Oh, that was bad. Oh, I really don't want to steal your sand, but I'm going to. I'm, I'm a little... Well, I'm not having much luck, sorry. This probably means you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna fall in. But it looks nice. I mean, it does look nice. It looks very, very nice. So, um... Yeah. Well, I'm not stealing that. Okay, C areas. This is where we're going to find more sand. Every time you see the mountain, you expect to see a bridge between them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, there's an area over there. I haven't done it. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. So, we have sandiness. Lots of it. Happy times. And I, I, yeah, let me go. I'm not saying that people who dislike Fallout 3 don't have some points about the things they don't happen to like about it. Because, of course, there are valid complaints about every single game in existence. Um, although I completely reject out of hand the assertion that Fallout New Vegas is better than Fallout 3 because it was made by the original developers. Um, I suspect that had very little to do with the differences. Um, I really do. I think the differences possibly came about... Is that clay? 
No, it's sand. Also sand. Toys, like you said, not dolls. To toys, toys, okay, to What's the difference between a toy and a doll? I, 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 are you being, like... Is, is this some strange... Like... Dolls are bad? Toys are not? Because if so, why? Surely that's just in your own head. You've, you've decided do dolls are bad and toys are not. Doll is human toy. Toy is non-human. Rubbish. Rubbish. Who told you that? Whatever. You know what? It doesn't matter. You get into semantics. This is the sort of argument I'm talking about, though. Silly arguments over what usually amounts to personal preferences. Okay. Leave that there, Ari. Right. Toys are collectible, dolls and art. Really? 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 Well, I guess somewhere out there, there will be somebody who has a collection of vibrators, because, of course, those are toys, too. But if that's the only definition for toys, then stamps are toys. Are we trying to come up with silliness? Is, is this random silliness hour? Toys are things you play with. Dolls are figurines. Or, you know, represent some type of living creature. They are a type of toy. But they're not always a type of toy. There are... Oh, God, I'm... I'm oh, I need to do some crafting. There are plenty of um, dolls that are not toys. You might have um, dolls that are uh, mannequins and that type of thing. They're just figurines. What a silly conversation we're having here. We're doing it again. Categorising things. For no apparent reason. Okay. Um, I, can't, I want to throw that away, but I know I'm going to pick it up immediately if I do it here. So let's go a little higher up. And throw those. Uh, potato. Gravel. Keep that. Throw that. Throw those. Got loads of those. Yes. Okay. Sand. And it's sandstone that I need a lot of at the moment because I've actually got a ton and a half of sand. Yeah, things like this, like like which is which game is belongs in a series. Very often, there just seem to be people who can't stand change, and th and that would be truly happy if. Oh ho oh, oh. ho! <laughs> Me? Where? What? The? F okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 drowning, drowning, big deal, stop it. Oh, okay. yeah. Underwater cavern, almost got sucked into and viciously killed. Gotta be real careful here. Who knew digging for sand could be so damn dangerous? Hooey. Not me, that's for sure. Okay, it's going to be dangerous if you keep digging down, though. Uh, 
And... Shotguns or rifles in real life? Um, I'm I, letting you into a little secret. I have never shot a shotgun in my life. I've only ever shot rifles and pistols. And no! Before anyone asks, because you know they're going to ask, we're not going to be going into, have you shot anybody? Because if you think I'd tell you if I'd shot someone, you must think I'm stupid. You may as well ask me, do you pick your nose? Not going to answer the question. Because I can feel those questions coming. Didn't deny what? Shooting someone. Of course I'm not bloody shot anyone. See, I knew it was going to be... This is going to be silliness. Complete silliness. Well, I'm not shot anyone with a gun. <laughs> That'll raise a bit of speculation, won't it? Yes, it will. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the chat made of that. He's... Do I feel like there's an underground cabin coming around again? I kind of do. Okay. Okay. All right, what was the chat asking this one now? Random ch Did I miss a tip? Sorry. Multitasking. Uh, something I'm really bad at. Is it, people often ask me, could you give me some advice on how I should, uh, you know, what's the best thing I need to do to make videos? And oh, I'm like, don't ask me. I'm the last person you should ask. Um, and nearly, what skills do you need to, 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 to be a, a YouTuber, a Let's Player? Um, it, it, the answer is, you need the one skill I lack completely. Multitasking. That is the, the, the task I, I just lack totally. Everyone thinks it's, oh, you, 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 you go, oh, I've got no sense of direction. I, I've, I've, I've admitted that one. Um... But people say, oh, you're not very observant. Actually, I'm a bloody observant person. Really observant. Um, annoyingly observant, let's, let's, shall we say. Um, I am that annoying person that misses absolutely nothing and can usually uh, tell you exactly what you did, how you said it, and what position you were in when you said it at lunch. Um... But I couldn't tell you if I was doing anything else at the time. Like, if I was on the phone with someone, I, I just forget it. If I'm on the phone with someone, I, I, I am probably like, I need to stand still. I mean, I, I can walk and talk at the same time, but uh, it better not involve any advanced navigation. <laughs> I mean, really. Chat's doing now. Short sure, sounds fake, but short sure. what? No, it's just people ignore purple and pay attention to pink. I 
I have no idea what on earth any of you are talking Are you still Mr. Tip and wandered off? I'm sorry, what tip did I miss? Go for walks into walls. Watch it, watch when I'm playing, watch when I'm playing occasionally and I'm reading the chat and answering, you'll see me bump into uh, doorways. In Minecraft, for example, you, you, will, you will see me bump into doorways. Because what I've done is I've looked at the doorway, I've headed towards it, and then I'm looking at the chat and I'm thinking about what you're saying and I'm on autopilot and I bump into a wall. It's, I just, I, I, I have no idea why, to be honest, especially when talking, I don't, I think a lot of it is when I talk and think about things, I, I very much visualize them, perhaps, perhaps that's it. Um, like a lot of guys, actually, guys are very visual um, creatures, and when I'm talking about something, I'll, I'll tend to visualize it, and sometimes I'm seeing that more than the thing that's right in front of my face. And at times, that's probably one of the things that helps me play the way I play certain games where, for example, I shouldn't play them that way. For example, Fallout New Vegas. People often ask, how the hell is it you play as if you don't know any of this? And that's the thing. What I'm doing, did you watch Lillehammer? No, I haven't. Um, because... Here in Norway, they don't have it with subtitles in English, and I can't stand watching things. So I understand Norwegian a bit, but I really get tired doing it. So I've got to find a version of it where there are actually subtitles when they speak Norwegian. Believe it or not. But I'm going to. I am going to watch it. I am going to watch it eventually. Um, big Sopranos fan, but then, you know, most people are. So anyway, yeah, so when I'm playing, say, Jack, and I'm, I'm sort of in... Oh! Bidulf, welcome. Sorry if I said your name incorrectly, and let's face it, I said your name incorrectly. So when I'm playing Jack, I, I am often really visualizing what he knows rather than what I know, and it's odd. It's something that I know what's coming, and yet. When it happens, I feel like I didn't know it was coming. Which probably sounds one step away from being insane. Or maybe not even one step away. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've actually... No, you see, I've got Netflix as well, and I'm pretty sure Netflix is global. So I could actually VPN it, couldn't I? See, I'm part of Netflix NO. I'm, I'm just wondering whether... Um, I mean, I assume I could actually go into Netflix.com and just... Um, you might not even need to VPN it. For all I know, I can I can just change the, the region settings. I don't know. I, I must check that out, actually. That's a good point. One of the advantages of um, this sort of uh, new media... The only reason I've said it like this is because it's actually on TV here. As you can probably imagine. Um, okay, that's not working because I'm not close enough. <laughs> Netflix is not global. Oh, there we go. Shame. That needs to change. Welcome, Karkashani. That definitely needs to change. These these companies, these companies that stream media or anyone, music, video, you name it, they need to get their heads into gear and get rid of region locking. Same with games companies. This is one of the reasons I love Bethesda. The game is going to release in Europe the same time as it releases every bloody where else. And you know what? There's no reason it shouldn't. None. It's old thinking for old media. The whole region locking thing. I mean, I understand why they lock prices for regions and I get it. I get they're doing it because, you know, there are certain places where they cannot afford 
because of the exchange rate, they cannot afford games. And so games companies offer their games to them for cheaper because a little bit of money is better than no money, right? And it gives those people the opportunity to play the games. And I'm, I'm all for that. So region locking prices. I'd love space engineers. I probably would actually, wouldn't I? Region locking prices I get. Um, I get, definitely. Totally get. 100%. Region locking releases and things like that, I don't get. It's old thinking. It's an old way of doing things. And they need to stop bloody doing it. And the same is true of all the streaming places like Netflix. If I've got, if I've got a subscription with Netflix, Netflix, I should be able to go into Netflix and change and say, I would like to see this as if I was in the Czechoslovakian Republic, i.e. I want Czechoslovakian bloody subtitles. Just pretend I'm there. Or I want to see it as if I was in America, therefore I get English subtitles. That type of thing. But only when they're speaking Norwegian. Anyway. Way off. We're way off base now, aren't we? Right. How much sandstone do you think I need? Should I start saving some of this sand for glass at this point? Of course, I am going to need some glass. Yes, I am. Should I start saving? I've got a lot. I've I've got a lot of glass. I've actually got tons of the stuff. Let's keep going for sandstone. Let's get it all nice and neat. Thank you very much. I get more sand. I don't I don't have enough glass. No, I don't. But I also don't have enough sandstone. I don't have enough of either. But what I want is enough to be able to get a lot higher. Basically. What I would like to have is is equal amounts of or, or, well not equal amounts, but enough glass to be able to fill up until I run out of sandstone. You kind of get what I mean, right? I'm sure you do. Totally sure you do. But yeah, I, I might, I might now save up. Okay, hello, 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 little Mister. Oof, yeah, it's pretty dangerous. That is. All right, this is going to be changing. You know what? I don't mind changing. That little bit right there. No, I don't. Okay. Oh, and one more row. One more row will do. How's that? Really? How is that? That's stupid. Don't want to damage the place too much. Any more sand? Little bit, little bit. So what's the chat on about now? I'm going to get all the Fallout 4 loot at. <laughs> Still trying to get me to go to the, to the Australian Gamecom thing. Teach us science or maths. And ICT? You mean IT. Actually, I'm, a, I'm releasing a tutorial soon on how to mod Witcher 3. Very, very basic one for people of very, very um, limited 
computer, uh, well, not computer literacy, but um, program literacy. Programming literacy, I guess you could call it. And even that's going to be like, it's going to be like 40 minutes long just to make a simple mod that puts my logo on your back. That is actually kind of useful. No, not the mod, but the, the little hair space. Okay, leaving that one. I'm going to leave that one too. Okay, where the hell are we? Where the hell are we? Okay, well, let's go this way. You never know, we might find another source of sand. Good grief. Seriously drunk sheep, I think. Huh. And another sandbank. I think I'm safe down here from the Enderman. Well, okay. Let, let, let's face it, what I really mean is I think the Enderman is safe from me down here. Don't like Enderman. No, I don't. Not going to lie. Five dollars. Oh, thank you, Essie. Thank you, Essie two. Was there an Essie one? If so, what did you do with them? Got some iron here. Let's go and see what the uh, surface is looking like. Enderman are people too. Yes, they've got to be dead people if they come near me. Sorry. I'm not pro-Enderman. No, I'm not. I'm racist against Enderman. And proud of it. I'm so racist against Enderman, I don't even feel the need to say some of my best friends are Enderman because they're not, because I bloody hate them. Uh, one dollar from coding and modding tutorials, please. I might, well, I, that's, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do one of them, at least. Showing you how to do textures and stuff like that. Um, but it's really, it is only going to be an absolute repeat of the tutorial that CD Projekt Red actually ship with the modding tools. It's just I've noticed a lot of people having some issues with those um, tutorials. And I can tell you, I actually had a couple of issues. I made a few mistakes when following the tutorial. Most of them mine. Um, but um, they can be confusing. Am I learning French? No. Sorry. Was I supposed to? Did I, did I miss a memo? Kit, <laughs> thank you. Ten dollars from Kill All the Endermen. <laughs> Your wish is my command. Yes, indeed. What's MXR and why is it not liked? I believe I can field both questions. MXR is another YouTuber who makes predominantly Skyrim videos about Skyrim mods. Um... He is almost certainly the biggest of the YouTubers who does Skyrim mods. Okay, get out of here. He is, I, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty convinced he's the biggest. Um, and the reason he's not liked is because he has a particular style and... Um, well, not even style. He has a particular preference for certain types of mods that some people do not like. And so certain people pretty much resent him for that, in my opinion. That's my basic opinion. And of course, I think they're wrong for this because, frankly, modding is a personal thing. 
And yes, what, what he does is big boob mods. And that's probably why he's popular, because he does mods about big boobs and big butts. Predominantly, big boobs, big butts. And here's the thing, and here's why I don't object to him. Firstly, why would I? Well, I don't care if people like big boobs and big butt mods. There's nothing against it, right? Um, secondly, it means I don't have to cover them. Because, <laughs> you know, here's, here's the thing. These mods deserve love too. I know some of you hate them, but it doesn't matter. The people who made these mods put a lot of work and effort into them. You know, I mean, I've said this before about, like, Schlongs of Skyrim. It's a pretty impressive mod, really, when you think about it. It really is. It's, it's an impressive mod. No arguments. I just, I don't, I don't want to cover them. It's not me. It's not my style. It's not something I would ever use. I occasionally like playing with silly mods, but... So he doesn't... So that's great. That's brilliant for me. But most importantly, the reason I don't have a problem with it is it's the sort of mods he likes. I think he genuinely makes videos about mods he likes. He enjoys. He enjoys the silly mods. And he's pretty unapologetic about it. He, he makes... He, he doesn't pretend to be serious. He doesn't try to be anyone but himself. And yeah, some people don't like that. <laughs> Fine. But he's himself. You know what? More power to him. And yes, he gets thousands, tens of thousands times more views than I ever will, right? And yes, am I a tiny bit jealous? Of course I'm a tiny bit jealous. I'm jealous of PewDiePie. Of course I'm jealous of PewDiePie. Man's making a fortune. Don't hate him for it. Don't dislike him for it. I'm looking. I'm now looking. <laughs> Why are we talking about... Why are we talking about... I don't know. Somebody, somebody just ask it. Immersive boobs. Okay, we, we, we need a bit more sand and then we will be done. Where the hell am I? That way... I'm going to head in this way. It's kind of back to where I'm... You used voila, imbecile, often. Voila. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We use the word voila in, in England. Welcome, Mambrosius. We use the word voila in English. And yes, we, we know it's French. We also use rendezvous, and many of us don't realise it's French. Dun 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 You just, you got in his way. You got in his way. You got me while I was high on adrenaline. And you just kept following me. No. Anybody else? Another Enderman, another Enderman. Oh god, it's Enderman City! It's Enderman City! You shot arrows at me. You're gonna die. God damn it, stop shooting! I am so gonna hit you. Where's the other Enderman? Enderman, 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 Oh crap. No, no. I even want your dingle things. That could be taken the wrong way. Five, thank you, broken, what, broken... I didn't like that bit of land anyway. Um, thank you, broken... Oh, God, I didn't read the name. I was too busy getting a little overexcited. Ooh. Fall off. <gasps> God damn it. Torture, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. 
Huggy. Uh, one dollar from Gopher to an AMA. What's an AMA? And can I be arrested for it? Oh no, if you blow up next... Oh, if you blow up next to the... Really? Could we, one at a time, please? Oh, could, it's like a never-ending supply of things to hit. Ding ling ling. Oh, don't knock me back. Don't knock me back to the. Don't knock me back into him. Oh my god. See that? My kung fu better than your kung fu. Hello? Okay, 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 okay. okay. Oh, you've got some dirt. You, and you, 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 and a. S <laughs> what the? Is there a bloody convention? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Gonna die. Gonna die. Okay. Food, food, food. Ask me anything. Almost anything. No, I am never gonna do an AMA. Well, does ask me anything mean I have to answer anything you ask? Because because if it does, then no, I'm never gonna do one. I mean, you can ask, but I won't answer. Um. I'm still looking for more likely to find it in that direction, right? Over there, but I kind of... Oh, that's a bit freaky. Okay. You don't have to answer. So, really, an AMA is exactly what I'm doing right now, except I don't play Minecraft at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The, the answer is probably not, because I'll probably get bored and want to play Minecraft. Okay. Two, two, two. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I can do this. I can do this. I can. I can do this. You see? That almost played a tune, didn't it? Are you? Come on, it's. Aren't you guys getting bored of dying by now? Gotta be some sand down there. Gotta be some sand down there. Right? Or is that clay? I think it's sand. Yes, I do. We actually probably got enough sand now to last maybe halfway up the bloody tower. Um. It'd be nice if we had enough to get to the next platform, wouldn't it? That would actually be very, very cool. Drank some hyperjuice. I didn't drink hyperjuice. I got two days sleep. Five dollars from... In the text Engelsk. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. English subtitles, that means. Just in case those of you who were trying to figure out what the hell that was. Uh, no, I've just had sleep. I had two days sleep for the first time in a long time. Uh, and yes, it makes a huge difference. Not gonna not not gonna be around a bush. Sleep is essential. You should always get some. That could be taken the wrong way, couldn't it? Be a bit rude. I'm probably getting close to some sort of limit if I want to keep the Enderman pearls, and I kind of do.
You you just blew a hole in the water, didn't you? Admit it. Can you do, can can that be done? Probably. Lillehammer on Netflix.no. It, it's on, but I, I, as I said, I think the problem with it is the subtitles. The subtitles are only on when they speak English and they're in Norwegian for obvious reasons. And I just find that very, very tiring. Oh, I can't even be bothered killing you. That's It's daytime. I can be bothered killing you. You're on the way. Are you trying to beat me to death? With a really, what the hell is going on, guys? Night of the Living Bloody Dead going on. Skydiving and salsa. <laughs> Great mix. Don't do them at the same time, though. I am. Um, God damn. That way. It's home time. Oh, I think I might have found more sand. I'd say I should remember the sand here, but I'm not going to. <sighs> so, am I going to get lost? I'm going to get lost, aren't I? Yeah, it's that way. Okay, so. Time is it? Oh god, it's later than I thought. It's later than I thought! I was going to try and have an early night. Do all... Do all... Uh, from any plans for Black Wake? I don't actually know what Black Wake is, sorry. But thank you for the tip. I don't know what Black Wake is. Do pumpkins look like that? I hear you. I hear you, you I hear you. Have you seen a giant glass tower around here? I'm, I'm kind of lost. It's over there. Thank you very much. Ooh. Whoa, with the, the storm sounds. Yeah, no, um, I'm trying to get back to the home and then Blackwake equals pirate FPS. Okay, that sounds cool, and thank you for the tip. <laughs> Uh, that sounds pretty cool. Pirate FP. My tower looks like a giant bloody corkscrew. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Let's just go get this zombie. See this Navy SEAL out of the water at death. Hobbies other than video games. Uh, none anymore. <laughs> Watching TV. Oh, guys, I'm trying to enjoy the bloody view. What is going on? Is Have I not been out for a long time and you've all built up? Is that the problem? Are you all feeling a little... left out? I was about to say, look at that. Ow. <laughs> Here's the thing. If I, if I took a screenshot of this and posted it on Skyrim's Nexus page, I wonder how many people wouldn't notice that this was a bloody Minecraft instead of Skyrim. What the hell? 
Did I just hear an explosion? What TV do you have or HTPC? I can't remember. I honestly can't remember what TV I've got. Really can't. Enjoying the view. Was that lightning? The edges would tip off. They might, but they'd have to look at it. Especially if I if I hid the trees. Let's hide the trees. I could call it corkscrew tower or something like that. Netflix, no subs info is wrong. Okay, thank you. I, I will check out Netflix later, I will. So there's lightning, really? Wow. Please try it. <laughs> no, I, I, it might even be against the terms of surface, service, for all I know. But how good does that look? How awesome does that bloody look? Well, yeah, if you look at the torches, you can see it, but just look at the tower. Focus on the tower and let the whole scene wash over you. It looks awesome. You know, there are some very, very negative people. You have to actually get pretty damn close before you start seeing the telltale signs, in my opinion. Oops. Okay. You know what? I really should build a bloody bridge across here. I, I think I come in and out of my house this way more than I do the, the actual front entrance. I mean, honestly, when was the last bloody time I actually used the real bridge? I'll be back. It's been a while, isn't it? Update your channel description specs. Okay, are my, are my channel description specs not updated? I'll, I'll try and remember that, sorry. You know what happens when you build a bridge. Yes, I get slightly obsessed. Same as when I build a... Listen. Lava tower. So... Right, um... We, I, I actually... I actually can't fit everything in it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need some more bloody... I am actually gonna need some more bloody... Uh, well, that's kind of a good sign, I suppose. Oh, no, 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 just, look at that, it just fits. Oh, I, I could have put some stuff in there as well. Okay, so we've now got a lot of sandstone. We got a lot of sand. Got to fetch an energy drink. Well, we're, we're finishing soon, we're finishing soon. We don't, we don't. We don't, you know, you're not going to need energy drink for, for a couple of minutes. All we're going to do is go and uh, slaughter the animals. Put our stuff away. And uh, we're done. Was that lightning? Because if so, it kind of sucked. You know what? It's raining, it's lightning. I don't want you to feel neglected, but I'm going to kill you another day. S same with the crops. I've got so much damned food that I'm probably going to have to make more bloody chests here as well. I know I don't need to kill them, I can shear them. Yeah, I don't 
I don't kill him because I have to. <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> that's, that's not what I'm doing. I'm not killing them because I have to kill them. What earth gave you that idea? Actually, that was a bit unnecessary, wasn't it? Chickens are scary in real life. That is actually ever so slightly true. You want to have some fun with someone, take them near a chicken, get about a metre, two metres away from a bunch of chickens, and then suddenly turn around and run away. All the chickens will chase you, and if your friend doesn't know what you're going to do, he'll suddenly see a bunch of chickens chasing him. And it, it can be quite terrifying. <laughs> For... As to why it's terrifying, I don't know. It's just chickens, right? It's just chickens. I don't actually need the uh, heads-up display, do I? I don't. No, I don't. I could probably play without it. And my god, it's beautiful. Let's just do... Let's, let's do a quick... Under the sea thing. Because I haven't done it for a while. He says, having been under the sea for the l most of tonight. I meant look at my tower. I want to look at the tower. In all its glory. As it reaches out. I think I'm drowning. Um... Oh god, this is... You know what? This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. This is this is really they couldn't be more perfect. I'm getting really dizzy. I, I'm actually thinking of throwing Really? There's no rain up here or did the rain stop? Don't I, I, I'm above the clouds. I can't see myself being above the clouds. Oh, no, that's annoying, really? I don't get rain up here? Okay, no, I'm getting it again. I'm getting it again. Second. Oh, thank you. And night time. Awesome. Oh. Um. Don't ask. I just, I want to be stood at the absolute top. Yes, I do. I want to be at the absolute top. Ha 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 This would probably actually be better without the shiny... See, that's the actual Steve skin, one of them. <laughs> there. And we're not even halfway up yet. We're not even halfway up, ladies and gentlemen. Oh yeah. Look at you, look at look at my island. Excuse me, well I look at my island. That's my house. That's my pier. That's my bridge. That's my gate to hell. This is, I definitely, once, once I get this made, I've definitely got to go down there and make light sensors and get some redstone lights. We definitely want some sort of redstone lights going to light the place up instead of torches. Yes, we do. Please explain what banter is. Banter. Um... It's kind of teasing chat, back and forth banter, where you just, you, you, you sound like you might be actually fighting with each other, but you're not really. And the rain stops. And the rain stops. And I carefully get back on the column that I seem to be almost falling off and survey my island from here. <laughs> oh my god. That's pretty damned awesome. 
Massive light pollution. Yes, it is. It is. Maybe what I should actually do is have light sensors and or a switch. But I would need a lot of redstone relays. I would need a lot of redstone relays. I'd be able to flick a switch on the top of my uh, um, building or something and the whole island lights up. That would be kind of cool. Jump and do a flip. No. I am going to end this stream at the top of my tower. Not that really that it's the top at the moment, but we're pretty high up. Yes, we are. We're pretty high up, stood here looking down at our domain. Thank you, Jump, for the bant. <laughs> but no, we're going to end it here with the moon behind us, surveying everything. Thank you for joining me. I will see you guys next time. Don't know when that is going to be, but I will see you next time. And my mouse broke. That's not the way to end a bloody stream. Oh, it's working again. Oh, sorry, it was the mouse for the, uh, for the render rig. My epic ending foiled by a wireless mouse. Oh, well. Anyway, guys, thank you very much. And I will see you next time.